Hello, welcome to my channel. Listen, today we're going to be talking about like you, okay? Take time out to realize that you have to like yourself. Because if you don't like yourself, guess what? It's going to be very hard for others to get along with you, for people to even like you. Because you don't even like yourself. So take time out to realize that liking you is very important. Lo even going further than liking you, learn to love you. Okay? You're going to have to take time out. You're going to have to take time out, some of us, and heal. You're going to have to take time out and reflect. You're going to have to take time out and watch videos like this on self-care, on your health and wellness, so that you can be a better person for yourself, at least, and for others, especially if you're a caregiver. You want to like yourself. Whatever you have to do, do it. You may say, well, I don't have the finances right now to do what I need to do in order to like me. Well, start small, okay? Start learning to um, pray. Ask God for help, okay? Okay? Seek out videos like these and uh, other stations on YouTube. They have a lot of positive and sermons and self-help and self-care. Should I say not self-help, but self-care? You know, the other day, I'm a shower person, but the other day, I just got in the tub and just, it was like, I couldn't believe I was in the tub because I'm a shower girl. I'll take a shower a day, shower two showers a day, whatever. I love shower. I love the water. Just love it. Just getting all over my hair, face, and body. But the other day, I got in the tub. And it felt, I was like, oh my God. Warm water and a little bit of, um, you know, uh, smell goods and, you know what I'm saying, some dove and spray, sp sprinkled it in there. Oh my God. And just sat back and just let my body just relax. That's what you need to do. That was pampering myself. And I felt so good. I'm just using that as an example. That's, we say we maybe don't have the money to do something. That's just something just to do so that you like yourself. Don't give up on you. Okay? Even if you're taking care of someone else, your loved one, elderly parents or spouse or whatever it may be, you don't want to get down in the dumps because it's so easy to say, oh, woe is me, oh, blah, blah, blah. Watch what you say. That's another thing. Do little things like bathing. I know you bathe, but I'm just saying extra things. Do your nails. Do something. Get away from the crowd. Turn the phone off. Turn the, the mess off if you can. You know, if you don't, have, you know, I'm fortunate because it's just me and my mom. I don't deal with a lot of drama. I don't, yeah, get rid of the drama. I don't deal with a lot of stress. I don't deal, I mean, I have stress, don't get me wrong, but I don't deal with a lot of excess. I don't invite a lot of people in to, because people can be messy. Okay, let's just get, let's just be real. We love people. Yes, we have to. We give, we love, we, 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 we're empathetic. But sometimes people can be very, very, very messy and toxic. So make sure you're watching that, you know, as you love your, like yourself, okay? I like to go further than like. I'm going to start with like, okay? Love yourself. You can love yourself, but maybe not even like yourself. Because maybe you made some mistakes in the past. Maybe you keep making mistakes now. Maybe you're doing some things that you know you shouldn't be doing. But let me tell you, that is not who you are, okay? Try to correct all your mistakes that you can and try to be a better person. Like I said, I mentioned prayer. Pray. Ask God to help you. Matter of fact, let's say this prayer together. Will you invite Jesus into your heart, okay? And he come in, he'll come into your heart and he'll help you, okay? You don't have to, but I recommend that you do because it has made my life so much better. Okay, trying to do everything on your own, fix everything on your own and like yourself because you're going to see imperfections in you. You're not going to like everything about yourself, but if you ask Jesus to come into your heart, he'll help you. Let's say this quick prayer before I go. 
Okay? Come on. Invite them into your heart. Say, Dear Lord Jesus, say, Please forgive me of all my past failures and sins. Come into my heart. Help me. Come on. Repeat after me. Say, Help me. Help me be a better person. Help me to love my neighbor as myself. And help me to serve others. I ask you to be Lord of my life this day and forevermore. He says, if you confess with your mouth and you believe in your heart, you shall be saved. Saved from what? Saved from a lot of things, okay? Saved from a lot of things. You prayed that prayer and you need more information, look at my, my email is down there in the description box and email, shoot me an email and maybe I can help you send you out some literature. Not maybe, I will send you out some literature or maybe if you have a question, I can help you if you prayed that prayer today. Share it with someone else and tell someone else that you gave your heart to the Lord today. And also realize that you got to like yourself, love yourself, and others will like you and you'll like others. You'll love others and others will love you. Okay? God bless you. I thank God for you joining me today. I hope something I said was of value to you today. We do offer spirituality on this channel, self-care, health and wellness, and caregiver support. To all my caregivers, God bless you out there. Keep plowing and plowing and like you. Learn to like yourself no matter what. Okay? Love you. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> I like me. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't, I don't want to be no other woman in the world but me. Okay? That's real love. God bless you. And again, I hope something I said was of value to you. If you like the content, please give us a thumbs up. Share and like. God bless.